What's going on, my ARD family? Good morning. Hope you're having an amazing day today. Hope you're staying positive. Hope you're being safe. Another lovely day here in Guyana, but it's raining. And as I, I'm talking to you, the sunshine is actually coming out, so it's a good sign. This morning, we're heading down to the Linden Suzdike Highway, to the creek. Splashman. Many of you guys wanted me to show you Splashman. I've been to Splashman Nature Resort on the other side, the other bank of the of the um, creek or the lake. Today we're going to the other side of the creek, the fun side. So me and the Floridians, my family, and my boy Arjun and his family, we're heading down to Splashman. We're going to shower in the rain. Don't you worry, we got in the black water and take a dip, alright? I hope the rain clear up. So come with me and let me begin another adventure. Alright, so we at the junction here. The Linden Suzak Highway and we waiting for Miss Lynch to arrive. Now the girl is a very careful driver. Oh, there she is making her approach. Alright. Right up here you can come and buy you. Stuffy man, you got you can get beers and things over there. And over here you get all your little balls and little floating device, alright? So the goodness continue. Wow. This Linden Highway is really really busy man. A lot of trucks, you know. It's the main road that leads to Brazil and most parts of the interior, you know. So it's really busy. The trucks were coming in there, so boy, we got be stuffy you now. And hey, look at them, look at them banks there icing down there, boy. All right, finally, we have reached Splashman. All right, see the outside still, the high water still flood. Splashman is not currently open to the general public, right? You have to own a property at the back there before you can get to access this place. So, my man Arjun have a house at the back here, so that's how we head in at the back there, right? To enter the resort, it will cost like on a regular day when they open, it costs one thousand dollars, five dollars US for adults, and five hundred, which is two fifty for children. Up by the rain burst. Rain star fall, everybody start drizzle. Yeah. So, you know, because of the bad weather and the place closed down, this is what it looks like right now inside. Alright. It's not to the best. They're closed, man, due to the COVID guidelines. This park is closed. So, we gotta go by the man, our June house, the man, at the back. Alright. But this is the beautiful splash bin. We didn't come here a long time. They make a lot of benabs now, all colorful benabs. Last time I came here, they were all truly. The shed was truly, not um, not zinc. Plus they're building more thing, things there. I guess they have accommodation at the front here now, so you can come and hang out. Yeah, they got some things going on at the back here, but it's a big things that go on in splash bin here, man. I might gotta buy a property here, buddy. A waterfront property. It's beautiful here, man. I wish I could have do a drone footage here, but because of the close proximity of um, the Cherry Jagan International Airport, I'm not allowed to fly here. I have to get permission from the civil aviation to fly. So it's kind of hard, you know? He says here, Madwini residents and hotel guests only. So they have guests house at the back here. So once you come out, you want to stay over, so you got guest house, right? Oh, the road, the road. Oh, it's a hotel check-in, so. This is where the hotel is actually, Madwini Hotel. These houses here, all right? Beautiful in here, man. Let 
me show you what's going on at the back here right now. They're doing some more development at the back here. A lot of these houses here, man. I wonder if any house up to up for sale here, but I can buy one, you know. We're gonna be up here a lot. Alright, so the goodness continue here, man. Them fella doing some work. And this way it looks like any back here. So this is the creek coming all the way here, the lake come all here. Them guy probably dig this part here. So you got share. You got a lot of um waterfront properties here, man. Right, a lot, a lot of waterfront properties. This is nice, man. Really, really beautiful. So we take one the bin officer. They got some event later on, but look, big tents and stuff going up. Boy, look at the beauty here imagine the atmosphere here boy and look we got a boat over there bandit place is calm man and doing some construction work i should have walked my fishing rod and i'll probably catch a look nanny here boy man so hey beautiful here man Life can't get better than this here, boy. I got fire up my stove just now, you know. And fry some nice, the man brings some red snapper there. Watch here, boy. Look at that. Watch the fish they here, us. Watch there. I, I should have walked with me fishing rod, boy. This place got fish. A big fish bossy does snow banners. Nobody ain't accessing the, the creek right now, so I got fish coming in close by, you know. It's four baby Lokananis. So many around there, look. Four of them. Wow. Look, 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 look. Come quiet, come quiet, Lokanani, look. What are you saying? Bring a fish here, right? I am bringing a fish here, I say. Look, Lokanani. I said, one oh, go on there, and you have three more over there. Big ones or little? Small baby oh, ones. Yeah. A big one played us, no, but I started didn't walk with my fishing rod, bro. Mm -hmm. We could have been fish catching fish, you know. <laughs> the find it. I think they fixed it. The up, boat, right? yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, how can life get better than this, boy? We got a park for ourselves. Luckily, my man got a house here, so we get to use the park. That one side is where everybody's allowed whenever they're open, but this one side is for only folks who live at the back here. Hey, we're good, let's continue. Hey, have not, a bang, have a beer. Have a bang, have a beer, by Happy birthday. Happy birthday. All right. Hey, how can life get better, by Look, we got a fine pan and we think so, you know. We got some nice good curry. What should we got here? Fresh pan, you are. Tony yesterday. Fresh out of the Atlantic. All right, good. We're going to fry in the dust now, by. I bring some gale back there. We got a lot of food here. So we got some nice chicken cook up. We got some, what, what curry you bring, Shardo? Yeah. Mutton, chicken. mutton and chicken curry by with some roti dal puri. Yeah. All right. Some hot and brown rice. And some brown rice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We got some Hennessy. We got some um, Bangs beer and some wine. Oh. Lovely, lovely. Yes, red wine. Look what's going on here, boy. Uh huh. The stove fire up there. Time for start fry them. Um, nice red snapper there, boy. Look here. Red snapper and we got some gilbaco. Over there got some gilbaco, boy. And look what we got here. Ah, look at the cook up right there, boy. Still steaming. Got some chicken curry. And some goat curry and mutton curry. Alright. I got like some cook up. Trust me. This thing? What good? Let's see. This tastes like, this is like a combination between Florida and Guyana. Cheers. Chat is show my cook today. Hmm. Got some flour that tastes into oh, it. Yeah. The goodness continues. I got my oil heating up there. I'll start frying the fish momentarily. Okay, great. Okay, boy. Red snapper sizzling there. If we had a fire side here, it would have been nice, boy. Alright. We got some 
Nice green plant in there, no? Hmm. Hey. The goodness continue by we having a good time. I like some cocoa price just now. These kids taking a dip. I cooking now. All right. All right. So them folks playing some volleyball, there, man. All right. We have Team Guyana and Team Florida. <laughs> Watch your ball, watch your ball! <laughs> so, it's definitely a fun filled day here, man. Watch the goodness, say why. Fish gone, fresh. Man, how the fish work? Good. Proper fish? Yeah. Are you one? Yeah, it's a pepper sauce. Yeah, it's a pepper sauce. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. Yeah, why? Only it. thing, you know, we got some flies around here, but hey, a long nobody ain't come to this place to cook out and so, you know, so these flies hungry. So yeah, they, might, they might come for food. <laughs> right, exactly. So we gotta provide food for them, man. <laughs> All right, so Mikey and them girls in there. Hello, hello, Tash. Mikey, Mikey, you're the captain. You, you're the talk. You're the barge. You're pull the, um, the thing at the back. So these boats not got engine. So Mikey got pull the boat. <laughs> so I'm making some other thing here, man. This place is transforming, you know. Looking really good. Them girls doing the thing out there, you know. They're burying somebody in the sand. I don't know who that is. Olympic? <laughs> so we have, we have the mermaid, the Olympic mermaid here, them girls say. Alright? This is a little big mermaid. <laughs> Hey, these folks have had a good time here, man, you know. Celebrating, jumping up. How can life get better than this? So, so the mermaid is making her way back into the water. Alright, alright. They're having a good time, man. They're having a fun time. You know, back in the days, this place used to pack, you know, a lot of folks all over, you know. I like how they build it now, they build it social distant now. All the sheds are, you know, way apart from each other. Beautiful, man. And the table is built in as well. This place has so much potential, so much goodness to it. Alright? Life is good. So, only... The residents here, or those who are staying in the um, in the guest house or the hotel at the back there, or the folks that live here, can actually access the creek right now. It's not open to the general public. Well, of course, thanks to ARD, you know, ARD got connections, you know, got friends. My buy ARD, you get a house at the back here. Once you have a house at the back there, you could access the um, creek. So it's bonus. That palm room planting, by or yeah. or Linden or Barbies. Where I come from, by? We can have. We can have planting. All right, so we got another chef in the house there. Eh? So the goodness continues. The gilbaco in the frost is yet. Still long here defrosting, all right? We're gonna fry this later. When the set finish eating out, then we're gonna fry it though. You don't wanna fry the fish like cool off, you know? You wanna get it hot, hot. So I have a gilbaco steaky. So you got some garlic powder. Yeah, but everything they don't know. Alright, yeah, powder. Baby. Yeah. Have we got some key, John? Alright. I'm making a steak in man, I get back a steak. And of course, we got some curry powder. To top it off, right? So when you're lashing. Gilbaka, you're lashing Gilbaka, and it got to be yellow. And don't forget, we the half grid, we need back down here, right? So that's the Gilbaka steak. And this is guy right now with me. Look at that thing there, buddy. Look at the goodness there. We the back down, or the creek. So we ain't got all convenience at home. So we making much with what we have available. So the goodness continues. Look at that lovely steak there, boy. All right. 
the goodness continue here man them girls come pick up them fry fish and, and fry plant you know what a surfing you yeah, play for the pay for the fry plant and the fry fish thousand dollars thousand surfing <laughs> that people sell cheap <laughs> so the goodness continue we got we plant we got we fish and look at this nice gilbaka steak by you <laughs> well we sell a chunk of gilbaka you fry the thing whole and here comes the rain beautiful sunny day here in the creek and man we got rain falling right now but nonetheless the folks in the in the creek there they're taking a dip and they get their rain from above so you get a double shower so there we have the boat tour operating you know, these folks are here staying in at the, at the guest house so they're going for a ride on the boat there man so you can come here and enjoy whenever it's open back to the public you can come and enjoy a boat tour but if you book rooms in here in apartments then you can have all these rides all right there goes our tour boat man beautiful as can be the lights are fading it's only about 3 30 but the dark clouds all right and over here we got <laughs> they got a little train going on, they got a choo-choo train. <laughs> Alright, they probably thought they got a speedboat. What happened? They just want to sink. <laughs> anyway, it's a good thing the kids are having fun. Bye bye, bye bye folks. Miss Lynch porridge in by the waterfront, so. <laughs> so we having a good time, we celebrating, you know. Chit chatting and waiting on these folks to finish up because I'm the designated driver for today. Alright? And there's your boat there. Take care, take care. Enjoy your journey, your trip. <laughs> yeah. They got the kids them playing. And the water edge, yeah. And the man got loud music too. <laughs> That's a party boat, loud music inside. All right, so I just paid for a boat ride, twenty-five dollars. Take us around the lake for a little tour, and look all the passengers on board here. All right. All right, so the boat could only carry ten passengers. Boy, look. The beauty here, boy, from the outside in the uh, river. Look, a big fish play there, boy. Is what kind of fish is there, friend? Lokanani. So, I see some little Lokanani for truth just now. No, no, a small no, one. I gotta come back here fishing, buddy. I'm coming back here fishing. Trust me. Smile and wave. Smile and wave, gentlemen. All right. <laughs> All right. Hey, how can life get better than this here, boy? Trust me, life can get better. Imagine living on this waterfront, this lakefront. Have a lakefront property. And yes, there are properties here for, for sale. So, imagine only one. This used to be the famous cricketer, Shiv Narayan Chandrapal. He once lived in this house here. Man, you have lands here for sale, you know. Um, Lands in the for the lakefront is about a hundred and seventy-five thousand US for one of these plot of land you see these houses on here. Alright. Now you have lands at the back you can get for like forty thousand US. So in case you want to come here and buy a house or a land and build a house, you can do so. Um there's not houses for sale, but you have lands for sale. And they have hotels here as well uh, as well to hotel accommodation. So if you want to come in you can come and stay over for the night. I don't know the rates. You can check them online. Um, Splashman. This place is Splashman Resort. You can check them online. And you will know exactly how much to stay here. Beautiful lakefront properties, man. This man got mango tree, boy. Catfish curry must have cooking there. <laughs> this man got to be cooking our Lokanani curry here. Yeah? And coconut tree as well. So beautiful here, boy. Life is amazing. 
so so and beautiful. Nice. This is okay. this Florida style, man. Yeah. Oh my God. It's moving from Tara coming up. Here. You wanna buy a lot here? I'm selling out, buddy. I'm coming up here. Forty thousand for a house, lot, girl. Look here, the part, Thirty-five up million here. for a house, lot. It's a big a big lot if on the lake front. Man, but across that side you can get for cheap for forty thousand only. But then you get the lake. No, you don't have access to. Well, you'll be at the back. Maybe this guy should drudge this place and go in farther in and you know just create a, a, a lake, a man-made lake. Man, it's beautiful here, man. This house, nobody like you live in there, best ever check it out and buy it. Y'all enjoy the boat, right? Yeah, yeah. Alright, alright. This is a unfinished house as well. Man, I just can't stop admiring these houses, eh, boy? Imagine waking up to this lake, eh? Come out, sit down in this street, okay? I catch Lokalani right there. <laughs> Life can't get better than that. Trust me. Man, look like a beautiful house, eh, man. permission and a permit to fly my drone from the civil aviation so you cannot fly in a restricted area so I cannot give you guys an aerial view I can do so but I have to seek permission from the civil aviation to fly my drone here and I have to coordinate with the Cherry Dragon Airport when there is no flights that's when I can able to fly my drone beautiful here man this guy's got a nice party and thing going on by wow these houses are beautiful here and this is the, the guy from his jumbo jet right yeah it's like a nice place at the back imagine owning a property like this so don't worry miss the buy one a front over there right yeah me and why do you know yeah. we just sell out and i come in <laughs> off the side trust me yeah. If you know I'll come, you still have come. So you're gonna sell. Alright, alright, folks. <laughs> alright, there. Beautiful house. Yeah, buddy, you come on a fishing when you want. Yeah. Nice boat and thing. Hey, I migrated from George, so I'm gonna come in on Eiffel Live. Yeah, it's the first of its kind in Guyana. Lake houses, alright? First of its kind. So you guys get a full tour of Splashman. Now we could buy a land here, Miss Lynch, on this creek or on the West Bank over that side. Nah, I think this side because you can get the sunset. The sunset. So you want to see sunrise, you want to see sunset? Alright, no problem. Yeah, no, right. So my sister she wants to see the sunset, so we gotta buy an eastern side property. Hopefully this guy could uh, you know develop that one side there. Make more houses, you know. Wow. Alright, so we are back. Wow. This is so amazing. The view. I don't mind make a little hut inside this bush over here just to wake up in morning time and afternoon time for so watch this beautiful scenery here. Trust me, I can live on the other side and look at the beauty on this side. If I live on this side, I wouldn't get to see the beauty. All I can see is these trees across here. <laughs> Boy. So. Hello, y'all smile. Y'all live on Titanic, you know? <laughs> yeah, so we're taking, we're taking a ride into the eco 
Park. Hier is namelijk om over hier en kook. Barbecue en zo. Last time we were here, we were under the big tent. They have some folks camping there, yeah. Yeah, the folks camping there, look at that. They're sleeping over. They got a tent. So we can come in here, you know what, and spend the night and sleep. And get a little boat and fish in. Wow. Beautiful. beautiful. Hello. All right. Uh -huh. <laughs> what's up? What's up, my man? <laughs> how how can life get better than this? <laughs> Good, my man. Yeah, my boy. Y'all enjoy, man. <laughs> cool, buddy. <laughs> One destiny. I love that, man. <laughs> what's up? What's up? How can life get better? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Nice, nice. These folks having a good take. A lot of camping and study back there, man. Nice. So awesome. Yeah, everybody. Everybody just celebrated having a good time the camping in. This is a this is a great idea, you know. I just learned something. I have my camping tents. I'm gonna come here and camp and go fishing. <laughs> wow, it's so beautiful here, man. Bye. Have fun. Life can't get better than this. <laughs> you got a lot of folks over there. What's the friend's name? Big up to all the folks of London, man. All right. <laughs> yeah, this is nice now. You know, what would be awesome if they can start building some cabins. The owner for this property should make some cabins over this water on both sides. You know, where you can come sleep for the night and just walk out on your on your deck on your pier or, or whatever you want to call the thing or your stalin <laughs> and you know just sit down and enjoy the water man hey life can't get better than this boy this trip this boat ride worth the entire day here in splashman trust me and i know and i know you guys are gonna love the sceneries here not for y'all look at come splashman i ain't bad to go by the jetty no more for fishing <laughs> so if you come Guyana please check out Splashman Resort yeah yeah aye aye captain <laughs> make sure you all check out this place and yes they have hotel accommodation here I do not know the rates I think somebody was saying about a hundred dollars a night US I'm not certain and you have you have rooms with two beds as well to accommodate you know families Life is good. So, so amazing, hey man. This trip is worth it. Now the sunset disappeared, but we're going to have the sun. Now it's five o'clock. We ain't seen the sun. The sunset, boy. Yeah, you running? <clears throat> and the sunset get away from me, boy. Oh, God. But nonetheless, the place started to get a little bit chill because the sun, you know, hiding behind the cloud. And this is a hilly area, so you know the, the weather has been a little bit more cooler. The temperature has been more cooler. Right now we have 82 degree. All right. We usually just get like 86, 87 degree. We got 82 right now. And it's kind of windy, so make it chill. One of these front property here is for about 175 US for the land. It's a really big land and it's like you know for the river front, for the lake front. At the back it's cheaper. But I think it's well worth it because you can live 15, 20 years longer if you live by this lake front here and enjoy what life and nature has to offer. They're having a wedding here tomorrow. So you can even come here and plan your wedding. They cater for weddings as well. All right, so. The goodness continue. The man drives speed there, boy.
Yeah. Hey, y'all enjoy your boat ride? Yes. Yes. I enjoy my boat ride. All right, all right. So, let's say they enjoy the boat ride. Y'all enjoy the day, fellas? Monday, man. Monday becoming too short for you now. Monday coming too short. You must be happy you missed your flight, right? Ah, <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this man missed his flight a week ago. <laughs> this man the happiest man on earth. Well, we make, we make, we make it up back here. Yeah, man, yeah. So, you're, once you're having a good time, man, everything, you know, good. I'm happy if you have a good time. Enjoy. Happy you want to go on the jet ski? You know, I'm so happy these guys are having a good time here. Even though they got their, um, their flight cancelled because of the COVID test. This guy doing some um, stunts there. Yeah, these guys missed the flight because they had the wrong COVID test done. And um, now they're happy they're, they're making it up back now, man. One week here. One week song long when you miss the flight, right? Yeah, yeah. And now the time is running too short, right? Because you're leaving yeah, you're tomorrow. Uh, 24, 24 hours, 6 hours, 6 hours left. <laughs> and now the trip becoming short, you see? <laughs> hey, today is well worth it. Trust me. We had a really great time here, really awesome time here. Unfortunately, this park, this lake is not open for the general public. You have to be a guest at the, at the hotel or if you're a resident here, at the lake well then you are allowed to come in all right it's not open to the general public but once it's reopened back this is a place to check out the splashman resort and lake the sunlight slipping away 5 30 sunset another half an hour 45 minutes you can get sunset and we're gonna make our way out of here so this is the atmosphere here right now man beautiful me and shot man already went and spoke to the owner for this resort we found out for a property um a piece of land we saw it for 8.5 million which is like 42,500 us affordable so we are seriously contemplating to buy that land and we're gonna set up a time sharing with the property a couple of us can come together and make a building and we can always come in here and you know and celebrate this lovely atmosphere here man this lake it's the first of its kind and mr john said he's developing the other side that's on that one side there he's developing that one side in another couple of months you're gonna have other lands for sale he has great plans for this place it's amazing so those of you who want to retire at a lakefront and you want to retire in um florida where i'm alligator there come to guyana we got lokanani here and um kofum and tiger fish and so tilapia so i definitely come, come back here and fish we camp and fish soon come so the goodness continue all right the boat ride so sweet i got a second trip a second ride <laughs> Yeah. You guys know this. <laughs> so we got another ride here now. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we got a new ride. Looks like I'm going to be captain this boat. So we on a second boat ride. The birds then passing by there. Carbon airline up in the air, up in the sky there. Look at the beauty of the sunset there, boy. Mm. Life is good. Can't get better than this, boy. Different captain this time, different crew. Another ride on the lake to give you guys, you know, a sunset ride. Look how calm and beautiful the water is now. Mm -hmm. Like we on the sunset pier in Florida by in um, Key West. So 
look at the beauty of the uh, sunset there. So these folks are making it off the mighty bandit boat. Look at the beauty of the sunset and now, mm, so amazing. Man, look how amazing that sunset is. Yeah, buddy, thank you, man. Boy, isn't this beautiful? Sunset and the lake. I now imagine how beautiful you folks in Florida that lives on the lakes and the beach, how beautiful it is, how much you enjoy nature and what life has to offer. Look at this. Tell me how life can get better than this. Hmm? Life is good. I definitely enjoy today here. On this resort. Definitely gonna consider that property here, boy. Definitely, definitely. I wanna thank you for your time on this channel. Hope you enjoy the day with me. Hope you had fun. If you love my videos, you love my work, kindly show me some love, kindly hit that like button. Please share my videos so more people like yourself can see it. Hey, thank you, I appreciate it. God bless you. Stay safe, take care of you and those around you. Peace out, and I'm gonna see you on our next adventure.